Yeah, come on in. Yeah, Johnson, how can I help you? Mr. Bro, we really need to talk about getting new computers. Hmm. They're too slow. Let's see. The computer has never, ever been wrong. Come on in. Hey, Mary Weathers. How's the job going out there? Sally cut her finger on the paper shredder and is bleeding profusely. Hmm. Let me see. Do something! Do something! <laughs> there you go. Glad I could help. Come on in. Hey, Kippers. How's the job going out there? Mr. Brew, the copy machine sent out a spark into the fire room and Mrs. Anders' wig is on fire. You got a problem? Hmm. Let's see if we can solve it. Access denied. Access denied. Access denied. Access to access to access to Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? Access I hate your guts. What you're looking at is the circuit board that we made on our CNC machine. I'll put a link up in the corner where you can watch the playlist of us actually creating this. Anyway, we thought we would go ahead and take the circuit board that we built and hook up the components and make a project and test it and see if it actually works. So let's get started. Got this little box from the five and under store. It holds candy. We're gonna use it for our project. The board fits in perfect. We made the circuit board with this box in mind. 
So let's get wiring this up. First, I gotta insulate the box, poke some holes in it, and get going on that. So I drilled a hole in the top with a paddle bit. Not the best way to go. That metal's not very easy to cut. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and glue this button in there now. And get it lined up. And there it is. That's just a regular arcade button. We had a couple left over from the uh, Raspberry Pi arcade build that we did. So uh, we thought we'd use it on this one. Okay, switch is done. I also need a place for the USB wire to pass through the back, so I'm going to put it right where that mark is. Done deal. Here's an old USB cable that I have. I'm going to go ahead and cut this end off there and feed it through the box. This is where we're going to get our voltage. Perfect. We could have went with a 9 volt battery. In fact, all our, our testing was done with a battery. Anything above, you know, really 5 volts, 5 volts or above. This voltage regulator later on here is a 3.3, so we're reducing it down anyway, so. But, you know, we want to leave it on all the time, and you'll see what it does and why we want that here in a minute. So I'm just going to strip these ends and connect them to the board for our power. So inside these USB wires, there's four wires plus some shielding. And the two that we're concerned with are the red and the black. The green and the white we're not going to be using, but this is our plus five volts and our ground. So what I'm going to do is just snip these other two short. I'm going to solder a couple wires to our switch to go to the board. Time to hook it all up to our little circuit board. Got our button hooked up and our power hooked up. All we have to do now is stuff in the box and try it out. Okay, where's the front of this? So it goes like that. There we go. Come on, okay. What does it do? I don't think I've told you guys yet, have I? Well, we're going to find out here in just a minute. Obviously, the button does something. You've seen the speaker, so figure it out. So I'm going to quickly describe how this thing works. When you first plug in the power, it uh, powers on with a signal. 
plug it in here. Okay, so that means it's powered up. And then in the default mode, when it's first powered on, it just gives the phrases. And it will continue to do it at random. And if you press it and hold down for three seconds after the message, it goes into a little um, hidden mode that Steve put in watch. Hold down. Okay, you heard the tone. Now it's in Mario mode. So, sometimes it repeats the same one, but it's random. <laughs> well, you wouldn't know it, would you? And then again, if you press it and hold down for three seconds, it'll go back to the quotes mode. Mama mia. Two, three. Okay, now we're back into the quotes mode. BB guns are dangerous. I don't want anybody shooting his eye out. It's not bad. There is the random sound cube. Don't really have a name for it. That's it. I don't like that talk.